from big companies to smaller shops. Bloomington's business community has it all, and companies of all shapes and sizes were represented during the second annual business day at City Hall. It's all about bringing everyone together to learn and to see how we can work better together. That's the president of the Bloomington Chamber, the group that teamed up with the city of Bloomington to put on the event. It was meant to connect business leaders with city leaders. The city uh, has a lot to do with the vitality of the community. And so it's really important for us to have a relationship with the people that drive that because it's really important to us to have a, a vital and, and vibrant community and a, and a place where people want to live. I think the transparency uh, in city government is really important and events like this demonstrate that transparency and accessibility and it just lends to that communication and exchange of ideas and information, whether it's constructive feedback or it's opportunity for ideation and future planning. It's just a remarkable event to bring people together for those purposes. The event kicked off with a presentation from city manager Jamie Verbrugge. He presented the results of the business survey, which showed 83% of businesses saw Bloomington as a positive place to do business and 93% of companies plan to stay in the city for the next five years. Overall, again, the, um, the results are very positive. Not much change, stable environment. Uh, the business community, I think, feels that this is a good place to do business. It's reflected in, in the survey, in the confidence within the community, uh, and the fact that um, uh, your, your opinion is a little bit higher than residents uh, tells us that um, we're doing okay. I will never say we're doing great because there's always room for improvement, right? Uh, we're doing good, we're doing well, uh, and we're looking to do better. I was actually really impressed by the business results. I wasn't expecting the numbers to be as good as they were, and so it was refreshing to see that the business community here is really proud of the city that we, uh, that we live and work in. After the presentation, everyone got a chance to dive deeper into those business survey results during roundtable discussions. And I was really curious to see how the second year in the survey had progressed, and I'm delighted to see that Bloomington remains a strong and vibrant community. It's fascinating how stable they are, and I think, again, it speaks not only to the strong business community here in Bloomington, but the partnership between the community, the businesses, and the city governance. Relationships that only got stronger after this event.